Welcome back to AKC Style, the place for figure skaters who want to learn how to skate their hearts out, compete at their highest potential, and spend as much time practicing their inner work as they spend physically training on the ice. Let's get started. Welcome back to another Come Skate with Coach Ashley video. Today, I'm gonna be practicing my forward inside and outside edge spirals. But as you can see at the start of this video, I did not focus my camera correctly. So this is gonna be a little bit of a shorter video than I usually do with my Come Skate with me because my camera work could have been better, <laughs> as you can see. Um, but I'm gonna be practicing both my forward inside edge and my forward outside edge spirals on both feet and um, give you some pointers, some tips, and hopefully the rest of this video is less blurry and you enjoy it. Okay, great. So I have now refocused my camera and now the video will be a lot clearer so you can actually see my spirals as I come back to you um, down the ice. So for anybody who's working on a spiral, especially a forward spiral, no matter if it's on an inside or outside edge or just going straight down the ice, I would really suggest you do a lot of stretching. Now, my spirals used to be a little bit higher than this, but spirals have always been an element that I really hated working on, and I don't enjoy doing them now, even as an adult skater. But I do make my skaters practice them all the time because it's something that I wish that somebody made me practice more when I was younger. So, that being said, make sure you do some off-ice stretching, both before you get on the ice and then also um, on the ice there are exercises and stretches that you can do, kind of like drills, to help you prepare for your spiral, I'd suggest. When you start working on your spiral, there's really three things that I always suggest that my skaters focus on more than anything else. Um, three things that really make your spiral a really nice spiral that people enjoy watching. The first is your posture, the second is the height of your free leg, so that's the leg that's gonna be behind you, and then is your toe pointed? So those are kind of like three things that you wanna look at. And as you start working on your spiral, there are a few tips that will help you with your posture and position. So you wanna think about having your chin parallel to the ice and eyes gazing forward. This will help you lift your chin um, and just have a better posture. Then you wanna think about bringing your chest down, but avoid diving forward, which is what some skaters tend to do when they're trying to lift their leg up higher. And then the final thing is to imagine that you're squeezing your shoulder blades together, and that's gonna help you with your arm and shoulder position. So I hope that these tips help you. I know it's a lot, but I'm gonna put them on the screen here in a, a quick little list. So um, hopefully you can look back at them later, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for listening today. If you found this episode helpful, let me know in the comments and be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. This helps other figure skaters discover my channel and also helps me decide what topics I should share with you next. Have fun out there and I'll see you at the rink.